Hey YouTubers, it's Tony with Mayberry Mini Trucks. Today is Wednesday, December 27th, 2023. And today we have a video of a Subaru Sandbar for Mike in Ohio. And Mike is interested in this Subaru Sandbar and it's a kind of a special Subaru Sandbar. It is a automatic Subaru Sandbar. And this is a, let's see, a 1998 four-wheel drive automatic Subaru Sandbar with 14,890 miles. And um, so this thing is super, super, super low miles. This is exactly what I try to get. And uh, this is an automatic Subaru Sandbar. So let's go ahead and let's check this truck out. So I'm going to go ahead and attach these chains so that way. They're where they need to be. Um, I tell people just get two five inch long pieces of hose and, and do two pieces right there. And um, that'll go a long way. It's getting dusk. Um, and so we're gonna do a quick video for Mike. Mike is a long distance customer. And our long distance customers are not able to come here and see the truck in person. So what we do as a proxy to their, you know, actual visit in person is we video it very, very carefully. And you see, as we come around the perimeter of the windshield, we have a beautiful windshield perimeter. Now, as far as the front of the truck is concerned, we want to look for damage and I don't see any. Now, something else I see is a very translucent headlight door, which is an extremely good sign. Um, when you see uh, something with that kind of clarity, the rest of the truck looks nice. That means it was kept indoors. Now, that was a water drop, so it's just got water drops. That is absolutely a beautiful door post, or that's actually the door pillar. Now let's look at this door. That is phenomenal. <laughs> oh man, that is so pretty. Look at the wheels. It's got beautiful wheels, beautiful tires. That's the Yokohama super van. Beautiful underneath. Now, the bedside panel, guys, is also ding-free. Absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous door. Gorgeous bedside panel. Ding-free. 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 Now, the bed. Look at this piece of artwork. <laughs> I mean, okay, this is what you call a four-washer truck. So all of the screw heads have a solid, unmolested washer. Beautiful. Look at the rear of the cab. The patina on all of this hardware is absolutely stunning. That is incredible. So now we do have some surface rust on that fender. So the fender has some surface rust. There's our spare tire. Here's under the bottom of the truck. Under the bottom of the truck. That bed has to get some sort of award. I mean, that is just stunning. The engine cover is magnificent. The back of the tailgate, guys. Now, I don't remember my last video but I'm going to say I know how that video went. That is ding free. Ding free. And, and just look at the condition of the corner. That, those are almost always banged up. Okay, see, we got a scratch there. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay. Ah, it was just water. Guys... This is ding-free.
absolutely dang free. Got a battery cover, which is nice. That needs to be screwed in better. Ah, can't do that with my fingers, but look at this. Look at this. This is the door post, coming down the door post. Let me just wipe that off and get a good view. Oh man. Guys, this is ding free. The whole exterior. I believe the entire exterior of the truck was ding free. And we're just getting down to the last minute of the sunset. Boy, is that pretty. Man, oh man, we had rain for days. Somebody here is picking up a town ace, a Toyota town ace, and it's going on that trailer. I used to have one of those trailers. I had a 50 foot car hauler made by Kaufman. I had it made especially for mini trucks. Nice. Little dirt, that's just dirt there. That is absolutely magnificent. Beautiful. Nice little hiding spot behind the seat. Oh, look at that. How appropriate. <laughs> that seat is gorgeous, man. Oh boy. I want to say the U word so bad. Wow. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. We have a little pick right there. Pretty amazing. Oh yeah. Stunning. Absolutely incredible. That's what 14,000 miles looks like. Okay, automatic, so we push in this button here, and then go down into drive, and this is a four-wheel drive, which is nice. Oh, this has power steering. Oh, nice. All right, now we're going to drive this and see how it drives. I already drove it at 60 miles an hour on this road about 15 minutes ago because it had mud all over it from the road, our dirt road, and I had to um, try to find some puddles to drive it in so that I could uh, clean off the mud. And it actually worked. So now we're going to try to carefully drive this thing as to not wreck it or Mike in Ohio will be extremely disappointed. All right, so now I'm gonna give it some gas when we go around this corner. So that's like almost 60 miles per hour. About good. I've got the defrost on. I would say keep it at 55 or 60 miles per hour. Um, 55 would be kinder. So there we go. Now we're going to go back up this hill and see how the power is. Mayberry Mini Trucks got Mini Trucks made street legal in the state of North Carolina. We uh, got Deanna Ballard and Sarah Stevens to help us with the legislation in the House and the Senate. It passed both chambers, and then Governor Cooper signed the bill into law. Mayberry Mini Trucks also services our trucks. We uh, use 5W30 full synthetic engine oil, and um, we change the air filter, the oil filter, 
and um, we we uh, check all the fluids in the front differential, the rear differential, the transmission, the transfer case, in this case, the transmission loop. And um, so we're going up a very steep hill now. And it is, uh, I don't want to redline it, but it'll, you know, you can um, accelerate up this hill, but I just don't want to tack it out too much. So it has ample power, no question about it, but I don't want to make it go too fast up that hill. Oh, this thing is a tilt bed. How about that? Well, guys, thank you for um, watching our video. We do appreciate it. And uh, this guy is picking up this Toyota Town or Light Ace. Looking really, really nice. I remember that truck. And uh, so thank you for watching our video. And uh, so, uh, Mike, if you're interested and you like this gorgeous Subaru Sambar, let us know. Our telephone number is 336-777-9957. And, um, and uh, we uh, appreciate your business. And what else was I going to say? Um, so I said that we service them. And we, um, you know, take care of all the things that we think need to be taken care of. Make sure that it runs well at, at normal operating temperature. We make sure that the four-wheel drive works. We make sure that um, the heat works. And, um, you know, we try to get all those things dialed in. And we uh, don't charge anything extra. So if we say, you know, this vehicle is, you know, $10,200, I have a feeling this thing was a lot. Uh, then that's all you pay. Uh, there are no extra fees. Uh, we also deliver. We charge $2.50 per mile one way. And um, we appreciate you watching our video. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel. It helps us out with our search analytics and hit notification. And then you'll be notified when we um, list, uh, uh, when we take a, uh, a video of a uh, recent delivery. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, man, it's been quite a day. I, I, uh, I delivered a load out to um, to um, I delivered two trucks to uh, Tennessee to um, uh, Zone Mountain, I think it was, or something. I don't know. I can't even remember. But it was way out there in the sticks. It was so pretty, but it was rugged, and. Um, I can't, zone mountain or something, load mountain. I don't remember, but, um, it was nice. And, uh, this one guy, um, bought, um, two mini trucks out in the middle of nowhere. He had 400 and some hundred, four, 437 acres, I think, or something like that. And the mini truck is perfect for what he's doing. I mean, it blows away the side by side, clean out of the water. Not that I'm biased. Well, I am. I'm extremely biased toward mini trucks. Guys, thank you for watching our video.